them, and we're going to show you some heavy bag drills to increase power and strength in your punching. We'll be going over uh, body punching, both to the body and to the head, and also another drill where we'll be shuffling from side to side as we would do if we had somebody trapped on the ropes and we were trying to get the correct position to deliver both uh, left hooks to the body, right hooks to the body, left hooks to the head, right hooks to the head, uh, both individually and in combination. Now Dean's going to step in here. We'll start off with just stepping to the outside, stepping over here, and throwing a left hook to the body. Bang. Perfect. Step, drop. The key here is step, drop, and pivot. Step, drop, pivot. Perfect. Remember here, key coaching point, do not bend from the waist. Bend from the legs. You drop into this. You do not bend over. You won't get any power if you bend over. The legs will be stiff and you'll have no power. Step, drop, pivot. Perfect. Try it again. Step, drop, pivot. Okay. Now, step, drop, pivot, and we'll go into a one-two left hook low and left hook high. Let me go over one coaching point here that's very important. And that is, when we throw a left hook to the body, and we're going to double up with a left hook to the head, very important that we step, drop, pivot, then we drop the left hand just slightly and bring it right up with another pivot. We do not go here and then way out here and back. So it's going to be step, drop, pivot, pivot. Got it? Very important that you don't take that left hand too far out. Left hand comes right off of your hip. Step, drop, pivot, bang. Good. Step, drop, and pivot. Bang, bang, bang. Good. Drop that left hand a little bit more and make a little bit of a circular motion there rather than take it out. Here's the, here's the look that we want to get on this. Here, step, drop, pivot, and then just a very slight bend in the knees because we're going to pivot again. Bam, bam. Okay? Not doing, here's one thing that you don't want to do when you do this. Don't come in here and, first of all, never bend over from here. Always drop from the knees. Very important. Never bend, drop. And when you throw the left hook in the body, do not get wide. It comes right off the hip. Bang, it's done with the pivot. Bang, and then you do not take it back out. No. Here, and then just a little circular motion. A drop, and right back up. Bang. Okay. Good. A little more of a, a, more of a swing. A little, a little more drop after the first one. Bam. Bam. That's it. That's what we're trying to get. That effect. Speed. Step. Drop. Bam. Bam. That's it. Right out of there. Let's try it again. Double hook. Bam. Bam. Good. Now try it again. Give me a little more drop after the first hook to the body. So, so you're kind of loading up again, but you're doing it as you turn. Bam, bam, perfect. Okay, now if we're going to go over on the other side here, we have several options that we can do here if we're going to punch to the body. One, we can be here and we can go into what essentially is a left shift. We'll just step forward with this foot and hook with the right hand. Same thing. Bam, bam. Step, drop, and pivot on the right side. Bam. Let me. Yeah, right in here. All right. Remember this. Don't get too far up here. All you want to do, you're right here. You just want to step right to here. You don't have to get all the way around here. We're here. We're right here. Boom. Bam. Okay? Bam. Bam. Good. Give me a little double, little drop on that. Bam. Bam. Okay? Right away. Remember, we're not taking it way out. Stay, literally stays in close. Bam, bam. Ah, that's a good one. All right. Now we want to go to a very good drill. When we have the bag, we'll be swinging slightly, and we're going to use a shuffle step from side to side. This is the same thing when we go up in the ring. We'll show you how it works if we have somebody trapped in the ropes. And that is, as the bag starts swinging, and I shuffle over, bang. Shuffle back, bang. Shuffle back, 
bang, building it up as they go. Shuffle back, bang. Do not get the arms out wide again. Once again, not bent over like this from the waist. Dropping from the knees into the hitting position. Step, hook. Shuffle, hook. Shuffle, hook. Shuffle, hook. With a little bit of a cover, just in case. Okay. Bang. Okay, we'll get started here. Okay. Shuffle, boom. Stay low. Bend the knee. Stay low. Bam. Shuffle. Right into it. You load and shuffle. Bam. Then. Then. Load and shuffle. Shuffle and load. A little more bend in the knees. Drop a little bit more. A little too high. All right. You're a little too high. That's it. A little too high. Bam. Bend those knees and fire. Bam. Okay. Bend. Fire. So we're following. He tries to get away along the ropes. We're right after him. Boom. Okay. Now, here's the other thing that we want to take a look at. That is this. We we'll start here. We're backing, we're backing this another good drill for you on the heavy bag. We're going to back him into the... Assume that with the heavy bag is our opponent and he's backed into the ropes. So we'll go jab, jab, shuffle, punch, punch, punch. We can go either side on that. So we got him going back. Jab, jab, shuffle, punch, punch, punch. Any combination that you want. This. The point that we want to make here is we want to get an angle so that we have good hitting. So in other words, if he's backed me against the ropes here, we'll show you this up in the ring. Now, we don't want him hitting elbows here. We want him stepping outside right away. Right out here, bam, get that angle. Same thing on the other side. He comes in, boom, right in here. Bam, bam, bam. Do not stay right in front of your opponent because here's what's going to happen if you do it. All that's going to happen is I'm here, he's here, I stay in here. Not only have I got stuff coming back at me, but I'm going to be hitting elbows and hands and everything else. Get the angle. Get off. Get off here. Bam, bam, bam. Then you've got a chance to win. All right. Bam, bam. Bam, bam. Never straight in. You get him backed up. As soon as you got him trapped, boom, off to the right, right away, and let him go. Bam, bam. Good. Other side. Bam. Now give me a different combination. Good. You can double up too if you want to. You can go one, two, and then bring the other hand around if you want. Bam, bam, bam. That's it. Now let's try left hook, right to the body, right hook. Bam, bam, bam. Good. Real good. Try it again. Bam, bam, good. So you can kind of be creative here with what kind of a combination you want to use. The important thing is getting the position so that you've freed part of his body to punch with. So that you've got room to punch. If I stand right in here once again, then I've got to come right up the middle. It's the only chance I have. Once I step out here, I've got a lot of angles to go. And I can go body, body, head, 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 body, whatever I want to do. You can be creative with whatever works for you, and you can be on either side. Either side. <laughs>